Well, it's nearly, well no, just over seven years have passed since the first video of this. Let's go have a look, see what's uh, changed. But first of all, even the way we get it up has changed. This is now a three-way uh, ladder. I mean, it means nothing except to say that the last one collapsed under the weight of, I can't mention his name, but there we go. <laughs> anyway, here we are. Uh, so, I think the first thing you might notice is that it's a little bit brighter. Uh, bit of carpet down, so that's nice. Um, but also the underside of the table, well, you can't see it anymore. That's now got a, I don't even know what you call it, a dress, curtain. Um, I mean, this bit is kind of the same. You know, it's still the same room, but as you can see, Hopefully, there's been a little bit of work done over the last seven years. Um, so we'll try and take it slowly. Um, look, there we go. Light number one, a window. Um, and then I think these are new up here. Um, I had them in the corners of the table last time, but this is much better. Um, over here, well, this is kind of newish, all of this kind of table area. That little white bit was the only bit that was there last time. But now um, we've got a whole side to put our rubbish on. Um, and I've literally just added these two little bit of shelving pieces just because. You can never have too many shelves. Um, talking of shelves, uh, we've got all of this here now as well, so that's keeping everything tidy. Um, the uh, the chair of despair is gone. The stool of the fool is the uh, new recipient of the corner. Um, uh, what else is happening? Oh, well, okay, so. Um, you can see that we've lost some shelves. Well, actually we haven't lost any shelves, but we've we've lost the one that was here only because I've just added all of the shelves are on that side to this bit. Um, now, obviously the brace is still there, but it's been covered up, it makes it a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. But, and I only really discovered this like two weeks ago, ridiculously, and maybe because I've taken away a shelf that was over here recently and also a little kind of dice tray holder here but you just cock your leg over you know no problem no need for gymnastics um i mean height is still an issue over there but plenty of room over here and even more room now what with um getting rid of the one side of here so look at i mean that's it's not had much added to it over the years, but you know, it's it's at least the shelf's a proper shelf now. Um, and actually, last time when I did my kind of little thing about all what's on my shelves, um, there was a lot of either unpainted or unfinished or not even started stuff. Um, all of this is now finished and well I think probably apart from maybe a steam tank um, and a godrack everything else has been painted by me so we're all done everything's finished um, we've got a TV in the corner here I've just literally stuck this onto this I mean this is kind of like wallpaper but not if you know what I mean um, it just kind of covers the rubbish and slowly you never know we might get this covered up with white dwarf covers or something but anyway this is a little TV remote stand <laughs> um, the, uh, the hammer still there best bit of kit for any miniature wargamer um, 
and the table now gets its own little light up. Um, underneath the table, even more organised. So all that cardboard gone, thrown away. Probably used it for a little while to build some buildings, but now, no, it's all resin. It's all 3D printed, but I don't know what you're looking for. It's still here. There it is. Still in it, still hiding, but still there. The game of fantasy battles. Warhammer. Um, that'll do, won't it? See you in, um, see you in seven years. Ta-da.